Hello boys and girls, this is Mrs. Placencia and myself along with my twin sister created this presentation especially for you guys and we hope it's going to reduce your boredom and possibly even stress. One of the things that we definitely recommend is playing games to kind of reduce some of that boredom. If you have either an electronic version of a game or a board game, we highly recommend it. Coloring is another fun option for all ages. There's actually research that states that when adults color, it helps reduce some of their stress. We also know that there's a ton of our students who are extremely creative once it comes to art, so we would love to see some of that artwork. Exercising is also always a very healthy option. Maybe grab a pair of sneakers and maybe do some jumping jacks or jog in place. For those of you guys who want to get moving but maybe aren't the biggest fan of exercise, that's quite okay. How about learn a new dance like the Renegade? Listening to music is always a fun option. Now, one of the things that we recommend is if you're feeling sad, definitely try and listen to some upbeat music. For those of you guys who own pets, I definitely recommend taking a few extra minutes and either playing with your dog or just maybe petting your cat. You can also connect with friends safely online and the keyword there is safely. Make sure that you never share any personal information. Another creative option that you guys can do is you can either write a story or maybe even a poem and we will love to see them one day. Another option might be to ask an adult permission and try and see if you can either learn how to bake or possibly even cook during this time. Scavenger hunts are always a fun option, so maybe hide a few things around the house and see who's the first one to find all of the items. If you want to just relax, then why not watch a movie? Now remember, choose wisely because if you watch a scary movie, you might have trouble sleeping at night. Reading your favorite book or maybe even reading a new book might be a fun option as well. Okay, boys and girls, this next option might seem a little extra scary, but maybe you're able to help out with some chores around the house or maybe even have a little extra time to clean your room. So for those of you guys who haven't started your homework yet, and I'm hoping that's not the case, maybe start working on some of those assignments. Another relaxing option might be to practice some mindfulness. Okay, boys and girls, we've come to the end of this presentation. We would love to hear from you and maybe some of the creative ideas that you're doing to not be bored. Feel free to email us.